Hey, what's up? It's the Nerf Herder, and my Marvel Collector Core is here. And this is the Secret Wars box, which should hopefully be really good. Uh, last, well, I can't say last month's box. The last box was the Ant-Man box, and they had some pretty major issues with quality control and just bad item choices. So hopefully they've rebounded and come out strong. I have seen a couple spoilers. I do know there's two pops inside, but I don't know which ones, but I have seen like, you know, like a glimpse of a picture. So let's crack it open and see what's inside. All right, I assume they're following the same formula as always. So we got a pin. We sure do. We got a collector core pin and it is Iron Man right there. And uh, that leaves the Collector Core patch, which is, uh, is, uh, is that Cyborg? Is that, I don't know, whatever. So there's that and that. And uh, so we're starting out pretty typical. All right, so what is on top but the comic book? So we got... The uh, Marvel Collector Core Secret Wars uh, variant cover, which has a Funko Pop on it. It's issue one, which that was a major thing last month with the, uh, I think it was issue number five or something like that. And uh, so it's the first issue. And uh, yeah, I, I think I already have. Uh, a couple of these from uh, other boxes, but uh, you know, this is a cool cover. So yeah, there you go. All right, moving right along, we will check out the shirt, which is the new Pop Tees shirts that they've been uh, coming out with. So uh, obviously it's a Secret Wars shirt. And, uh, oh, look at that. Okay, so that wasn't Cyborg. That is, see, I haven't, I, I don't know anything about Secret Wars. So is that Captain America with wings and, and goggles? I'm going to have to look it up because I honestly, uh, I, I haven't cracked open one of those Secret War uh, comics at all. So I don't know all the characters. So, yeah. Yeah, interesting. I just made myself look like an idiot, but it is what it is. So there you go. That is a cool shirt and uh, Yeah, yeah, awesome All right, and for our first pop we got spider-man exclusive Miles morals Spider-man So uh, yeah, he's really cool looking check him out and now I can see the back, so I'm guessing that the other one is Thor, because uh, it says right on the back, Spider-Man and Thor. So, let's see. I'm just going to drop it. Oh, yeah, sure is Thor right there. So, we got Spider-Man, and we got Thor as the exclusive Collector Core Funko Pops right there. So, that's awesome. And I got no box damage. They, uh, they did a very good job keeping them intact this time. But, you know what, kitties? That was all that's in the box. And, uh, yeah, look at that. They did put a divider here for the Funko Pops to help keep them secure. That uh, wasn't there in past boxes, so there's a new addition. They are looking out for uh, shipping errors. Look at it. I do have a slight crease in mine right there, but I'm not going to fret. It is what it is. But, uh, yeah, so there, all this in the box, yeah. All right, so let's recap this. We got the Spider-Man exclusive Funko Pop right there. We got the Thor exclusive Funko Funko Pop right there. We got the Secret Wars shirt right there. 
And of course, Secret Wars issue number one with uh, Collector Core exclusive cover, which has a Thor Funko Pop on the cover, which is pretty cool. And then, of course, uh, we've got the Collector Core pin and the Collector Core patch. So that is the Marvel Collector Core for August 2015, the Secret Wars edition. Uh, very good, very good. You know, uh, variety, I mean, Ant-Man wasn't bad, but it was all just Ant-Man, so it was like a little repetitive. Uh, much better, because you got a little more variety. So yeah, yeah, very cool, awesome. And as always, thank you for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel and visit my blog at www.thenerfurterblog.com. And that is all for today. I have no more boxes coming in. So, till next time, goodbye.